guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to show you how to get my everyday makeup look or a more natural look. But before I do that, I want to show you guys a product that I've been using that I really love. Actually, really love a lot. And I use this before I apply my makeup. And it's called the Vanity Planet Ultimate Skin Spa System. So if any of you know me, you know how important it is to me to take care of your skin and how much I love taking care of my skin. Especially since I just had my baby boy last month. My skin from being pregnant is definitely not the same from before I got pregnant. So this thing is a lifesaver. So I just want to talk about it just a little bit and share with you guys a review, how I use it and all of these parts that come with it and what they do. So it comes like so. Super cute. And the thing I like about this is it's waterproof, obviously. So you could put this in your makeup bag, your shower bag if you're traveling, or you could take it in the shower with you. It's all right here. So that's awesome. Then when you open it up, you have your main face scrub and two dual face scrubs. This is pretty much awesome for all skin types. So this is what it looks like. And it just takes two AA batteries but it doesn't come with batteries, FYI. It has two speeds to it. So that's the first one. So that can be used if you have more sensitive skin or you just want a lighter wash on your face. And then the second one is the higher speed. And as you can see, super soft bristles, super nice. The second one is this one, which the bristles are a little bit uh, more rough. So I like to use this on my body. If you like get a spray tan or if you um, do self tanning like me and you can't get it off, use this in the shower just on those hard areas, a good exfoliator on there and that works like a charm. And then the next one, the last one, is this and this is to unclog pores you can kind of see pretty much amazing and you can just pop this thing off like that pop this back on switch it out and the one thing I really really like about this is I like to use it before I apply my makeup because it makes me feel like my face is glowing and I got a nice spa day without going to the spa so it's pretty cool so if any of you are interested in getting one of these ultimate skin spas i will link the link to purchase it down below with a 70 percent off discount code so if any of you are interested in seeing how i do my everyday makeup look keep watching all right let's get started so today i'm going to pull back my hair so that we can start by first putting on our primer which will be smashbox photo finish Now for foundation, I'm using Studio Fix by MAC in the color NC20. And for concealer today, I'm using MAC Pro Longwear in the color NC15. So I also use this to cover my blemishes and to highlight my face. Okay, and so I am using the MAC Pro Longwear concealer as well in the color NW45 to contour my face, but I definitely do not recommend this. This was so hard to blend and it should only be for concealer. I definitely wouldn't use this to contour. But also I just wanna add those concealers are awesome and I only used a tiny bit, they went a long way. To set my face today, I'm using L'Oreal True Match in the color N4. For my eyebrow pencil today, I'm using L'Oreal Brow Definer in the color Brunette 
and I really love this um, eyebrow pencil because it's super cheap and it's a great color for blondes. Now I'm just taking that same concealer and I'm going to highlight underneath my brow bone and above just to give it a nice little highlight. Now I'm going to hold all of that in place with the Clear Brow Gel by Anastasia Beverly Hills. Now I'm taking Soft Brown by MAC and I'm going to kind of just contour the crease of my eyelid. And so now I'm just going to highlight my eyelid with the Anastasia Beverly Hills um, Contour Kit in all three of the lighter shades. So now for contour, I'm taking all three of the bottom colors and I'm just going to contour my cheeks, my forehead, my jawline, and don't forget your neck. So to add a little bit more depth to my eyes, I'm just taking the same color Soft Brown by MAC and I'm just gonna kinda go under my lash line and above my lash line. So I just got this new blush that I really love. It's called Peaches and it's Sheer Tone Blush. And I feel like this just is such a natural blush color and it's pretty perfect for a natural look. So when I curl my eyelashes, I typically do this step maybe two or three times. For mascara today, I'm using Tartist by Tarte. So now on to lips. I bought this on Amazon last week and I just wanted to try it and it actually plumps my lips, which is kind of cool. So I'll kind of show you guys how it works. So I left this on for about 30 seconds and they're kind of plump. And for lip liner today, I'm using Subculture by MAC. I really like this lip liner because it's pretty natural and I just shade in my whole lips with this. And then I just add a nice chapstick and I'm just using Blitzdex. Now to add a pop of highlight, I'm using Too Faced Candlelight Glow. And this is the final look. This is my everyday makeup look, so I hope that you guys liked it. And if you have any questions, leave them down below.